Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I hope all is well. Everything is okay with me and I'm back with another video. So um, I've noticed that you guys really liked the last video I posted on my channel about the first pick I bought on AliExpress. And um, a lot of you had questions about um, how the wig is doing right now and if the, if the curls are still manageable or if it matted out. So as a matter of fact, I'm wearing the wig right now and in my opinion, it looks way, way, way better than um, the first time I styled it. Um, so you guys do have to know that it was my first wig, so I also had to get used to it. But... Um, in the video, I did a fresh wash and go because I did have someone uh, comment it uh, under the video um, that my thumbnail looked nothing like the video I posted. But I do have to say that um, I did a fresh wash and go on the wig in my video. And um, the older the wash and go gets, the bigger the curls get because in that video, the curls were tight and defined. And um, um, the picture on my thumbnail was a picture from a few years, uh, I'm sorry, a few years, from a few days after uh, the wash and go, which I just refreshed the hair with water and um, every morning and that's it. The flip over method was quite easy because I have a little bit hair out in this wig um, because as I mentioned in the last video the gap was very small so I I had to leave some hair out and um, so how I did uh, the flip over method I'm gonna show you um, I'm looking at the mirror thinking she's thinking what is she doing so I just did this and this is how I did the flip over method. It's nothing special. So as you can see, the, my own curl curls matches um, the curl pattern of this wig. And um, this is how I did the flip over say. Um, the styling product I use this time is the Can to Leave in Conditioning Cream. Uh, I'm very new to this product, but I really like it. And it's a nice thick cream, nice for the winter. Or for me, my hair loves this cream and this wig loves it as well. So every time I did a wash and go with um, this cream, this leave in cream only. And every time I'm refreshing the hair with water, um, I do add a little bit of this cream on the ends. Because they sometimes look a little bit dry. And um, yeah. That's it. Like if you um if you're gonna experiment with wigs or you're gonna try wigs, um just like me, um I would recommend this one because it's very affordable and um if you're new to wigs, don't buy an expensive wig and ruin it or you know I ordered this wig on AliExpress because I'm new um in this wig world and um I didn't want to order an expensive wig and um, regret it. At the end so this was very affordable it's a very great way to get used to wigs and if you like it you can go for a more uh, a better quality or a more expensive um, uh, wig so this one is very affordable yeah. um, order a bigger cap size especially when you're natural because uh, you know our hair is thicker our natural hair is thicker and it has to fit in the cap um, thank you so much for watching guys and um, see you next time. Bye bye And this is how I refresh my wash and go step by step I a scarf around around my edges to So they can be and um, yeah, I take the knot out And that's it that's how I refresh my uh, 